what is good? What's good? Me and my brother just got to Pasadena and this is gonna be trip to the thrift. Numero tres, mother. Wore a hoodie, but it's a little hotter than I expected. But we out here, it's all good. We're at the first spot. We're at this Goodwill in Pasadena. Goodwill and donation. Store and donation. My girlfriend's Asian. We're in the shoe section. And first off, I already found a pair of all gray roaches. Pretty clean. Damn, these are like brand new. Probably taxing on it. 20 bucks. That's actually not bad though. Might be a cop. Damn, Daniel. Damn, only 13. That's not bad. It's got some New Balances right here. Some runners, Nike, Nike. Looks like it's gonna be a cop. 20 bucks. Let's get it. Oh shit, you found a polar bear sweater? Man, fucking Giordano piece of shit. Oh, Kelly Clarkson. Let's go! Picked up a pair of uh, all gray, or gray and white runners, some roaches. Brother came up on some uh, elongated high fashion. <laughs> Show me what it is. <laughs> Show. <laughs> oh, hey. And then he came up on the, uh, well, I found these for him. He got the Oregon, Oregon colorway Nike on the side, big ass spell out. Nike on the side emblem. And then you can see right here, it's legit vintage. Let's go. On to the next one. Salvation Army across the street. <laughs> Over here though, Salvation Army. This looks like a mini ass Salvation Army. But you never know. Let's go. Found some Jordan 9s. Taxing though. 60 bucks, but they got no laces though. Thrift mm. store got me again. Oh, you thought it was Tommy? Oh, Tommy Bahama. Angels. <sighs> Found the elongated Zara little fishtail right there. But you didn't know. The sleeves. Zipper was good. Little gold hits. Elongated drawstrings. I think this is a cop for him. Let's go. So, brother made the purchase of that Zara elongated with the zipper sleeves. And the lady was nice enough to tell us that that was actually the boutique store for Salvation Army. So this is the this is the actual Salvation Army. That one was like the uppy prices for the more expensive items. So we understand. Gotta make sure you got the hand sanitizer on deck. Just wanted to let you guys know that I am sorry. I apologize that I have, um, I apologize for not having posted a video while it's been a week it feels like fucking forever but i've just been super busy with cutting hair school and everything else starting my internship soon so i mean i have been thrifting but i just haven't had time to actually record so in this haul at the end of this video you are going to see the stuff that i did come up on previous or prior to this uh, trip to the thrift you can see my stuff too yeah you can see his stuff too but yeah, so I will show you guys all the stuff that I've been coming up on and it is pretty fire. So make sure you stay till the end of the video. Didn't find anything at that Salvation Army. There's a reason why they send all their stuff to that boutique store because they leave nothing in that store. That she was boo-boo. Shout out to you, boo-boo. So now we're here at uh, Axe thrift store so we're in the sewer section and we found these jordan 11s i don't know why they have lace locks on it though i think they just put them on there because these 11s i don't think they have lace locks they're pretty beat but they're only charging six bucks i don't know if i could kind of restore these they got a little bit of detachment right there these might be a potential cop size 14 though Gator. To ask to see that starter jacket. I don't know what it is, but we shall see. Look at my brother's fish right here. This was hidden behind the counter. Bulls satin starter jacket. It's got the NBA logo right here. But this it wouldn't be on this. And look at the back. 
Oh my god. $90. That jacket was 90 bucks. Uh, Yelp had a check-in for 20% off and they had a deal where you could buy 20, pay 20 bucks for 30. And that owner was tripping. She tried to tell me I could only buy one coupon. I bought two, so I ended up only paying, what did I pay, 58? 58 total for the jacket. So, that was the steal. Let's go! So that last thrift store had hella heat. We're at Valley Thrift. This is the local one to our humble abode. And yeah, hopefully we keep the heat coming. Let's get it. In the shoe section, got some yeah, beet roaches, 14 bucks. And some red sock runners. Cheetah print. Uh, some weird Adidas slip-ons. Oh, got some Air Maxes right here. These are actually pretty clean. Got these baby Timberlands right here. Pretty good condition if you got some out food. Got some uh, LeBrons. LeBrons. Ain't gonna win the championship though. Got these vans right here. Got a black and white action. Um, got these ASICs. Pretty clean. In like the China colorway. Jordan 1s. Yellowy. Nah. -uh. You already know. Found the vintage guess. Blue tea, very basic, but it's vintage. Let's go. Beep bear? Yeah, and this piece that I just found right now, this shit is hella copter. Is this in the three? The white color, it hasn't even released yet. Let's go. Hey, this is go up or not? I know. Shining in this lady staring at me. Booty. No. What's up, bro? About to go on your roller coaster or what? Yep. Yeah. We're about to hit up one more thrift store Salvation Army, maybe Goodwill. You know what you gotta do when these bad bitches come through. <laughs> your boy Anthony already going in. Hopefully we don't find shit. <laughs> oh shit, oh yeah. I found the boots you've been looking for. Aren't these the, the big ass? <laughs> Got some Nikes. Why do all these freaking shoes have no laces? Why? Why, 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 why? We're in the other shoe section. Got some Nike runners. Climb a cool Adidas runners. Uh, Reeboks. Nike? Oh shit. My bad. Damn, dang out. Samoas. Cookies. Found this polo jeans cut off right here. Polo jeans company, Ralph Lauren. It's actually got a pretty dope spell out on the sides. Both sides. Nothing on the back, but they tax in six bucks. I'm not sure. These shoes are obviously from my boo. Duh. When you hit the thrift store, and it's hot as fuck, but you find shade. At the last thrift store. Goodwill. This is the last thrift store. At the last one, I did cop the uh, yellow colored uh, Air Maxes for the poop boo. So she'll get them later. She's gotta clean them up. Found this super dope San Francisco 49ers. This is a Jeff Hamilton uh, jacket. You can see right there, it's big. NFL. Damn, the shit fell. My bad. Big NFL on the back, in the inside. And then on the back, it's got the big, big patchwork sleeves, got the stripes. But the only thing, someone chewed the neck. Nice. Got some runners again, women's. Hey, Tommy Sandals though. Damn, I have to pick these up for the girlfriend. Look what we found, guys. Fucking bitch. Bitch. Fuck, dude. Oh my god. This was a freaking polo sweater. Oh god. This just makes me want to cry and go home. So, we decided to hit Uno Mas thrift store. 
Uh, we're at a, another Goodwill because it's by the place that we want to eat. Very nice. Very good condition, size 13. Though. Size 13, I think they're pretty good. So that was pretty dope. Uh, for the first time, uh, two two kids, they look like they're like in high school and they just came up to me and they were like, do you do YouTube videos? And I was like, yeah, I actually do like thrifting and all that like in the area. And then they asked me to show them my YouTube channel and they hit me with the subscribe button. So let's go. Finally home. About six hours six hours and like seven thrift stores but well, well worth it because we came up on some fire so let's get into the hall peace what is good what's up youtube um so i am back in my room now and i'm gonna do the haul real quick and i'm gonna show you guys everything that i came up on prior to this trip to the thrift because i have enough time but let's get into this it's about to be real real fast vintage nike snapback you can see right there, it's got the white hit in the back, Nike sign, you know it's vintage because it's got the Nike logo. Picked up this right here, Formula One Racing, it's actually a starter crew neck, dead stock. Picked this up from Goodwill, front and back. Next piece that I came up on is this um, vintage Mickey denim right there, Mickey ink, you see the back, it's got the big logo on the back, Mickey ink right there. And then you can see the emblems. They're actually really dope because it's like Mickey on each button. Vince Carter. This is actually a USA champion jersey, a practice jersey. You can see the champion logo right there. And it's actually reversible. This is the doper side, Carter in the back. There's a USA in the front. I picked up this for 10 bucks from a Goodwill. Right there, American Apparel. It's a bomber, essential piece. This one's going to the private collection. This is a vintage um, Nike windbreaker. Probably gonna try and sell this to round two. You can see right there, vintage logo, reversible. It's in like this Gucci colorway. Another vintage Nike piece. You can see right there on the inside, once again, legit vintage Nike. It's actually a polo. You see right there, it's black, black and cream. And then in the back right here, it actually has a big logo in the back in the back oh he picked up a collectible i found this at salvation army right there space jam collectible toy always good to keep in the collection vintage guess just a uh, basic t-shirt but the vintage logo so very dope these are about to be my swimming chunks for this summer super clean tommy hill figure you know i had to do it polo bear this is actually a more recent one, Ralph Lauren, but I just picked it up. It was only two bucks. This is for my girl because she's been looking for a new pair of running shoes. I found these at Salvation Army. They're actually Air Maxes. You can see right there, they're in the yellow, gray, and black colorway. Very clean. These were only four dollars. Let's go! You guys also saw that I picked up these right here. These are actually dead stock. You can see right here, no dirt at all. The tread's still there. Brand new pair of roaches gray colorway you know that's one of my favorite colors lastly the holy grail bulls starter in super good condition you can see right there starter logo you can see the starter on the inside right there but the best part about this jacket is the back look how big that logo is all stitched in this thing is like brand new just doesn't have the tag and right here on the side it's got the nba logo right there so yeah, this was the super dope piece. I was so hyped on finding this. And I, it was ta <clears throat> It was priced at $89.99. They were taxing on it because they know what this is worth. But I talked them down because I used discounts that I had, like coupons, 20% off, $10 off, all that. And I ended up only paying 58 for it. So this was a super dope come up. Hope you guys enjoyed that trip to the thrift. I know this haul was quick, but I had to do it. I found so much stuff to fit in this one part, so it was gonna be kinda hard if I took my time to go in detail. Maybe I'll do another video to do a more um, detailed look on all the pieces. But yeah, sorry I haven't been uploading for a while. I've been very busy. But um, thank you guys once again, and always remember, amen to fashion was good.